Hey guys, it's me Jello Pinet and welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, we're gonna do a comprehensive review of the shoe cleaner. Thank you so much for tuning in today and I do hope you guys are having a wonderful day. And if you're new here, please make sure that you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. And if matagal ka na rito, maraming salamat for sticking with me. Meron tayong mga cleaners. Ito yung mga lumalabas ngayon na shoe cleaner. I don't know how good they are. First is we have this thing, shoe cleaner mismo. And as well as meron siyang shoe deodorizer. Both of them came in spray bottles. We are gonna try them on this NMD R1 na triple white. As you can see, medyo ano sila ng konte, ayan, para medyo no blocking light. This is just from normal walking. So I had my friend Del, so si Del, shout out kay Del. So si Del ginamit nito ng one week, pinagamit ko sa kanya para talagang siguradong madudumihan ang sneakers. Fortunately, nakuha namin yung gusto naming dumi. Hindi siya hindi mga ketchup stains or hindi yung mga ganun. Yung yung normal lang na dumi na makukuha mo from the usual or from the, your everyday walk. Kumbaga, gusto namin malaman if this is this one will be effective first on the normal dirt. And as well as guys, nabili ko to kay Human Rims. So, he's selling it for I think Nasa 300 pesos itong cleaner at 200 pesos itong deodorizer. So to start off with this cleaning, dito sa NMDR1 sa to, what we're gonna need is syempre your shoe trees. Next, so since this does not have a brush that came along with it, gagamitin ko yung sa Clyde, the hard bristle and the soft bristle brush. Alright, so to start off with this cleaning, number one is put in your shoe trees and adjust them to size. Luckily, I already have them adjusted to size. Actually, kahit di mo natanggalin yung laces, uh, I would think na okay lang kasi ano lang naman eh. Kabaga, ang, ang attention ng cleaning na to would be based sa mesh and as well as kung kaya rin yung uh, linisin ng konti, uh, the boost and as well as yung outsole niya. So as per instructions, no water needed. All you have to do is spray this dun sa, sa sneaker. So we're just gonna be cleaning one sneaker for now. And I do think, looking at the camera, mas madumi to kaysa dito or ano ba? Left or right? Ito na lang. So ito na siya. Uh, and meron siyang lock, so you just have to unlock. So sabi nila, no need to wash it. Simple steps is number one, just shake it. So shake natin siya. And then, here's what we do. Spray natin siya. Sobrang dami ba? Hindi, ta tama lang. Since we're, we're working on the uppers, we're gonna be using a soft bristle brush. So let's see if it foams up. And this is cleaning. Hindi siya masyado nagbubula. Uh, I don't know why. Perhaps kailangan pa natin. Additional. Um, yeah, what do you think? Okay ba? Or medyo... Parang nagiging, nagiging discolor siya. Pero it's a good sign kung nagiging discolor siya. We'll start working dito sa sides. Dito sa may three stripes as well. Okay. So, yeah. I think medyo, medyo umu-okay siya. The question is, gano, gano karaming spray bago mo siya mapaputi talaga. It's foaming up a little. Kon konti, konting foam. Pero I don't really think na mag-foam up talaga ito eh. Alright, tell you what. Tanggalin natin yung laces para pati yung loob malinis natin. Alright, so start spraying here. Okay. And also, do not forget to clean here because this is one of the dirtiest parts. It's a sock liner. So we are almost done. Actually, hindi ganun ka linis yung, yung sock liner. Uh, you can see na may dumi-dumi pa. Pero, um, I would think super deep clean talaga ang kailangan para dito sa sock liner na to. Like, kailangan 
pa, pa, pra, probably washing machine. Pero kung brush lang and ito baka hindi. Now let's move on guys sa midsole. Check natin kung kaya niya paputi ng boost. Well from uh, right now makita niya the boost is a little yellow as well. So hindi niya kayang tanggalin yung yellowing nito. There's a separate process on how to unyellow boost. Pero the thing is yung dirt lang ang kailangan niyang tanggalin. So with this we're going to be using a hard bristle brush. Shoo, if you want to sponsor me, contact me lang ako. Thanks. Alright, so, midsole, check. Medyo pumuti siya. Uh, comparing it sa kanina. Okay, and lastly, outsole. Let's see kung kaya niyang paputiin or kaya niyang uh, i-improve ang itsura nitong outsole. Again, hard bristle brush, start scrubbing. Hmm. Yung mga black dito, hindi niya kayang tanggalin. Okay. So, yeah. Outsole looks pretty good. Pretty decent. Still looks used. Pero, it was better. Alright, guys. So, here's what we're gonna do. Um, I'm gonna leave this uh, to sit in the sun. And in fairness, pabango siya. So I'll leave this outside or tatapat ko sa electric fan para mas mabilis siya mag-dry. And then, we'll go back with yung, ano, yung, let's compare it with yung madumi. Pero wait lang, may nakita ako. Wait. By the way, disclaimer lang, hindi ko na, hindi na ako nag-focus sa sock liner um, area. So ang pinocus ko is the knit, the, the uppers, okay? Uh, the boost midsole and the uh, outsole. Niya. All right, so we'll be back in a couple of minutes. All right, so we are back, uh, and it took two hours to dry the sneaker. It's still a little moisted, pero ito na siya. Ayan. So it's a little cleaner than yung kanina. Okay. So if you compare it with yung dirty one. We can see here na it this one of course this one is better dahil na, nalinis na siya. However, sock liner hindi masyado and as I mentioned earlier sa video na to na hindi ko focus yung sock liner more of yung mesh. Okay, when it comes to boost naman sa boost well basically nalinis naman yung boost. So if you compare it side by side dito sa madumi, yung madumi yung nasa baba, okay naman, okay naman like it's pretty fair. Linis naman yan. Natanggal yung dirt. Uh, although, syempre, yellowing. Andyan pa rin yan. And ang uh, makakasagot lang ng yellowing is soul sauce. Overall, nalinis niya yung sneaker. Which is a good. Yun naman intention natin. Just to, number one, loosen the dirt. And then, ma ma matanggal lang natin. Before we end, syempre, we need to check muna kung anong amoy na itong shoe deodorizer. Yan. So, shoe deodorizer. Uh, kung ginamit mo na yung shoe cleaner mismo, mabango na siya eh. Like, hindi mo na kailangan talaga nito. Pero just for the heck of it, try na natin. Mm. In fairness, mabango siya. Hindi ko lang sure anong klaseng scent yon Like, hindi ako very particular sa scents. Pero... And after a whole day of wearing your sneaker, I would suggest na sprayan mo ng deodorizer para this one would kill kung ano man yung, uh, kung ano man yung germs na nakuha ng sneaker mo inside para mm, smells good pa rin siya right uh, after. So anyways guys, I do hope you like this uh, comprehensive review. Comprehensive talaga eh. No? Comprehensive review ng shoe cleaner. Shoe the ultimate shoe cleaner. Shoe, shoes the dirt away. They are available dito kay Human Rims for this one for 300 pesos and this one for 200 pesos. You might get them uh, higher elsewhere or you might get them lower elsewhere. I don't really know. Pero dun ko lang kasi to nabili. So I do hope na may natutunan kayo in this video. And if you like this video, please don't forget to smash that like button. And if bago ka dito, please make sure that you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. And if matagal ka na dito, maraming maraming salamat for sticking with me. So anyways guys, maraming salamat for checking on this video today. And I'll see you on the next video. Peace guys.